Hello, good morning. Y'all, I'm coming to you from my office. I'm in my pajamas. I've been out of bed about 45 minutes at this point, and I want to talk to you about energy. I promised that I would tell you how I have so much energy to get through my day, to get all these things done. You all notice in my videos and you've commented so many times that I'm always happy, I'm full of energy, full of pep, I love to smile and laugh, and you ask me, what is my secret sauce? I'm going to tell you in my video what is in my secret sauce. <laughs> Somebody actually sent me a message and said, what is your secret sauce? And I, I laughed. I loved that term. And, and so that's what I'm going to refer to in this video is my secret sauce. This is actually going to be a two-part video. This is part one, and I'm going to talk about one thing, the number one thing in the ingredient list of my secret sauce. Top of my list, the number one ingredient in my secret sauce, Verilux happy light. It helps me get through my day with energy. I'm happy. I'm motivated. I'm focused. I smile. It just, all of the things that you all see in me, this really is me. I'm not, I'm, it's not a put on for the camera. This is what I'm like all day long. And after I've been out of bed about 30 minutes in the morning, this is just what comes out. In this video, I'm going to tell you why the happy light is so important to me, what it does for me, the benefits, how to use the happy light, where to get the happy light, and why I think you would benefit from a happy light. So let's get into it. Let's all be happy with our happy light. I discovered a happy light about five years ago. I overheard a conversation of some women saying, talking about a happy light, and I did not know what they were talking about. And I actually walked up to these women and said, I overheard you. What are you talking about? What is a happy light? I've never, I'd never heard that term. I'd never heard of a happy light. And they told me what it was. I thought it was a bunch of BS. I did not believe them, but I came home. I got on Amazon. I started Googling what is a happy light. And in my research, I realized I had what I considered the winter blues. Every year, once it turns fall and my days are gray, I did not feel like myself. I had less energy. I was just kind of mm, and yawny and tired and... I was still happy. I still smiled. I was not sad. I was not depressed. I just didn't have the mm that I had in the summertime. I live in Kentucky. I'm filming this video in early November. But the consistent overall theme of fall and winter here is gloom. Gray, cloudy, gloomy days. We don't get a lot of sunny days and natural sunlight. I don't get to go outside and just feel the sun. And that is something that I crave. I thrive on it. I'm an outdoor person in the spring and the summertime. You will always find me outside. But in the fall and the winter, I just can't do that. There is no natural, bright, sunny days. I was missing the sun. My body was missing all of the benefits that I got in the summertime from being outside in the natural sunshine. And because of that, my physical health and my mental health and my energy level and my ability to focus and the way that I sleep are all different in the fall and winter. I bought a happy light. My world has changed and I'm I'm not exaggerating. I'm not joking. I'm not um, trying to sell you all a happy light. I promise this is made specifically for the winter blues. It helps you overcome fatigue and increases energy. And very important, it resets your sleep cycle. In the winter, I find that I have a hard time getting a full night's sleep. 
I can fall asleep easily, but I will wake up during the night two or three times and I wake up and then I just have to like lay there and lay there and, and get myself to go back to sleep. And it's because the natural sunlight regulates your sleep cycle. And in the winter time, when I'm lacking that sunlight, my sleep cycle is all askew. And so the happy light resets my sleep cycle and I'm able to get in bed, fall asleep, basically instantly as Grandy. Like no joke, my head hits the pillow when I'm asleep and I can sleep the entire night without waking up during the night. I start using my happy light every year faithfully. Y'all, I can't live without it. And, and I'm, I'm being serious when I say that I can't live without it. But I start using my happy light at the 1st of October and I will use it daily up until the end of March, early April, whenever the, ch the weather has changed kind of permanently into springtime here where I live. And when I'm able to go outside and get the 30 to 45 minutes of direct natural sunlight on me. That is when I stop using my happy light. So a good six to seven months of the year, this is part of my daily life. The happy light truly, truly has been life changing for me. <laughs> and it's just, it's so hard to put those feelings and emotions into words, but it just honestly gives me the energy and the pep and the spark in the, the, the light that I just need inside of me to, to, to live my life. And it gives me everything I need to get through my day happily, full of energy. I don't run out of energy. I am spunky and happy and smiley. And I'm that way anyway. It's just during the winter months, I'm lacking some of that. Like my, my energy level in the winter months goes from a 10, which is, which it normally is every day in the summer to about a six and a half. I guess that's maybe a, a good way to put it. I go from a 10 in the summers to a six and a half in the winters. That is really a good way of describing it. So the happy light brings me back up to a nine and a half to a 10 and just puts me back where I normally am. I get out of bed in the morning and the minute I wake up, I am, I can feel that I'm happy. I can feel that I have the energy. Okay, this is going to be a really great day. I am feeling good. I slept good. I'm happy. I, it's just a feeling. So this year I treated myself and I upgraded to this version of the Verilux Happy Light. The version that I have here is $69. It's available on Amazon. There are different shapes and sizes and levels. You can get some fancy happy lights with bells and whistles. I just, I didn't really need all that. I just wanted the timer. And this one came with the brightness level and the shade of light, which is kind of cool because I have tailored it to what suits me the best. So this is where I keep my happy light on my desk. So I wanna show you all exactly how my happy light works. And this is the newest version of the light that I recently bought myself a couple months ago. And it is Verilux brand, it is paper thin. Look at that, it just sits on a stand and I keep it right here on my desk. And this new updated light has some features that my old light didn't have and this is what they are. So every morning when I come in here to sit down, I'm, I'm gonna turn on my light push the button on the top. There we go. So I have three features. You can change the type of light, like the color of the light. You just find the one that suits you. And there are four brightnesses. So this is my favorite feature. This is the reason that I got the upgraded light is this middle button is a timer. And so if you touch the timer and then you'll see it light up, so each little bar represents five minutes. And so I sit in front of my happy light every morning for 25 minutes, and this counts down for me. I do not have to remember what time I turned on my light and what time I'm supposed to turn off my light. If I need to get up to like go grab another cup of coffee or run to the restroom, all I have to do is tap that and it pauses the timer. This is so great. So when I come back, I just touch it again and there it is. 
This is my favorite thing in life right now, y'all. But the timer, the timer is just critical. Here comes these two. Right, Moody? The Moo, and here come Paulix. Guys, can I finish recording this video, please? Can y'all do this somewhere else? Oh my goodness. If you do get yourself a happy light, let me give you some tips and some pointers. Put your happy light somewhere that it that you don't have to get it out and plug it in every day. That's why I have my happy light sitting here on my desk because every single morning I do computer work. So it just makes sense for me to have it here. I know that I don't have to get it out and plug it in and look for it and mess with it. It's just part of my desk. There's somewhere that you normally sit and have breakfast or have coffee or on your desk. And if you need to take it to work with you and put it on your desk at work, that can also be a fantastic place for it. You do not look directly into the light. You want, that's why I look at my computer, but my happy light is shining in the direction of my face. My eyes are open, but I'm looking at my computer. I am not looking into the happy light. You need to do your happy light in the morning. Don't do this in the afternoon. Don't do it at night. It needs to be a morning ritual. You want your happy light to be about, this is 24 inches, two feet from your face. The further away the happy light is from you, the less benefit you get from the happy light and the longer you need to have it on to receive the benefits from the light. You don't want it super close to your face. So for me, two feet is perfect. So when you first get your happy light, you do not want to turn it on for 30 minutes and just sit here. Your body has to acclimate to this light. So maybe do it five minutes the first day, 10 minutes on day two, 15 minutes on day three. Then you're gonna work up into increments and I'm going to turn this light off. I have already sat in front of my happy light today for 25 minutes and just having the light on me for the 10 minutes that I've been filming this video, I could already start to feel that I had too much of the light. So I got to turn it off for the rest of the video. But let me explain to you what that feels like. You know, if you drink too much coffee, you get just a little bit of a anxiousy, jittery feeling. Well, that is what that is what I'm feeling right this moment. I have had too much of the light on me. So, that is why you want to work into the light when you first get it. Take the first week, work yourself up in 5-minute increments. My maximum, all that my body needs is 25 minutes in front of the light. You may find that all your body needs is 15 minutes or you might need 30 minutes. You will know, you will get that feeling and you know it's time to turn the light off. But just take your time for the first week when you get it and work up in increments. Find what is right for your body. And then once you find that level that you need, then just use your timer. If you get a version that has a timer and the timer is excellent, the version I had before this, oh, let me go get it. Let me show you my earlier version. So my old happy light I used to keep in the kitchen in this cabinet. So every morning I would have to get it out, remember to get it out, set it up, plug it in, and I would sit right here at my kitchen counter and drink my coffee with my happy light on me. But this was my old trusty happy light. I had it for about four years. Still the Verilux brand, but look, I, look how thick that was. And there was no timer. It was just simply on and off. So the dogs and I are going to get on with our day. We're going to go for a walk. I have things to do today. I'm energized. I'm motivated. I feel good. My head is clear. I do not feel foggy. That is something that I think I failed to mention in my earlier um, talking about the happy light. Sometimes I feel brain fog. I just am just murky. I don't know. I mean, do you know what I mean? And the happy light eliminates my brain fog. Brain fog is something that I definitely fight with in the winter time. The happy light clears my brain. It eliminates the fog. Um, I'm clear, I'm clear, I'm focused, I'm happy, I'm energized. My eyes are wide and bright and I just truly, truly benefit from the happy light. 
I can't say enough positive things about the light and what it has done for me personally. If you are somebody that has any of the things that I talked about in this video, any of those feelings, any of those emotions, any of the lacking, any of the qualities of life that I talked about, please try the happy light. There is no negative. There is no downside. If you try it, try it for a week, try it for two weeks. If you don't like it, if it does not eliminate any of those things, then just return it. I feel like there are so many of us that could benefit from the happy light. We just don't know it exists. You don't understand the benefits of it. You're embarrassed or don't want to tell people that you feel low energy or fatigue or you're just not yourself for some reason. And I think you should try the happy light. I really, really do. Now, when you get a happy light, it's going to take a couple days. It's going to take you sitting in front of the light consistently for three or four days before your body starts to get back in sync and realize the benefits of the light. I see no harm in trying the happy light. I love mine. It is part of my daily life for probably the past five years. I love it. I tell anybody that I run into that talks about being tired or not having energy or how do I have the spunk to get all this done, I tell them about the happy light. If you are somebody who is tired, yawns all day long, just feels sluggish or fatigued or not motivated or just is missing the spark or the spunk or the energy or the, I don't even know how to put it into words. I just don't even know what to call it. Get a happy light. Try it. If you don't like it, if you don't feel the benefits of the happy light, return it. There is absolutely no downside. There is no negative to trying the happy light. I am not endorsed by happy light. They do not sponsor me. I just, it's something that I feel so, so, so strongly about that I feel obligated to tell you all about it because I am so often asked about what is my secret sauce. The happy light truly is the number one thing that affects my life and my energy level. And I just feel like it's my duty to tell you about it. Just please give it a try. It's available on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description box below to the specific light that I have. And I think this is the best version of the light because of the timer, because of the um, shades of light. You can choose the one that suits you and the four brightness levels. So you have options. You can tailor it exactly the way that you like it. But beside that, get the light that you want. As long as you get a happy light, get the one that you want. As I promised, this is going to be a two-part video, but video number two is going to be full of some great little tips and tricks, things that I do every single day that keep me going all day long. We're going to head out for a walk. I hope that you have a fantastic day, and if you don't feel like you're going to have a fantastic day, maybe you need a happy light. I'll see you later.